Hi, I'm Dale Wolfson and welcome to Compeer. At Compeer, we believe in the healing power of friendship. Hi, I'm Lynn Bueller. I'm the director of Compeer Sarasota. I've been the director since April of 2015 and I'm proud to be part of this organization and love the people I work with. Compeer is an organization that has been around for about 40 years and our objective is to really uh, match one-on-one -on -one individuals who have a diagnosed mental health disorder with a volunteer in a mentorship type relationship. The objective is to raise friendship. I'm Bernice Skirball, better known as Bunny Skirball for the last, um, I'd say 50 years. Uh, I'm fortunate that I was given the opportunity to found a mental health program in 1975 called Compeer. I took it from being a small, friendly visitor program in Rochester, New York, to a New York State program, to an internationally recognized program. And I feel so fortunate that I, being the executive director and president until I retired, and then I came down to Sarasota, Florida, thinking I was just going to retire. I wrote a book about Compeer, and I was going to volunteer and help other agencies. Lo and behold, there was a wonderful woman in our community who said, we need Compeer in Sarasota. And they turned to me to help them during this process. And today I feel so lucky to be the chair of the board of Compeer Sarasota. I feel, I many times say, Compeer when I started it, it was my baby. Now this is my grandchild. Hi, my name is Karen, and my match is Marjorie. Hi, my name is Marjorie, my match is Karen. Okay, so basically when I met her, I did, um, I wasn't gonna tell her a lot of stuff, cause like, I don't know why, but this is not in her room, but I feel like she's gonna switch me out or something. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like she was gonna switch me out or something, but like, <laughs> but when I started Actually. telling you, not in a rude way, not in a rude way. <laughs> but when I got to tell her everything, she was so trip. Not switch me out, but like if I was doing something bad and I told her, I felt like she'd tell my mom to like protect me or something, but she, <laughs> she kept all her my secrets to, to herself. Yeah, this thing that I like. What I think a best friend is like a person that you could tell whatever to and like without without being nervous of them telling anybody. And so, like I said, I tell her everything that I don't tell anybody else. I don't even like, there's things that I tell her that I don't tell like, my mom or anything like that, but yeah. Marty really listens to me when I talk. She knows I'm always on her side. Whatever she chooses, I'm on her side. Yeah, that's true. I love spending time with Marjorie because she's always fun. She always tells me the truth of her life and I tell her the truth of mine. We have a good time. We always do different interesting things together and mostly I just love being with her. Hi, my name is John. I'm a volunteer with Compeer Sarasota. I've loved being part of Compeer. As someone new to Sarasota, it not only was about helping Nathan, but it helped me find a friend and find an excuse and a reason to go out and try new things in the area. Probably never would have made the effort to get out of the house. So it's actually been really helpful for me to get to learn and engage more with the community I live in. Uh, and it's really, really nice. I mean, I love hanging out with Nathan. Uh, he's a great friend and it's really cool to see how much he's grown in just a few months together uh, and open up and become more socially confident uh, and confident in himself. Join and Alvin. Jay Steele. Jay, he's a great man to be around with. He makes me laugh like always, and I I just like asking about his family, so. And we just have lunch together, go fishing together, and everything. When I'm interviewing somebody to be a computer volunteer, one of the questions I always ask is, do you have a lot of friends? Because if they say they do, or even if they say they only have maybe two or three, but they're good friends, then I know that they're probably a good candidate to be a compeer friend. I'm Paul Smilo, and I am uh, James's buddy. And this is James. So... Hello, I am James. 
Compere is a program that brings together volunteers in a supportive friendship relationship with a child or adult as an adjunct to therapy for the purpose of helping them on the road to wellness. Helping them reduce their isolation, building their self-esteem, making them feel that they are a worthwhile human being. And we say that we don't require any special background. If you care, you qualify. The reason many times I'm asked, why does Compere need to raise money if the service is provided by volunteers? The reason we need to raise money is that Compere is a program that is professionally administered. We need to have a professional staff overseeing the initial screening, interviewing, matching, and monitoring training of the volunteers and the relationships. The other thing is that we do not charge for the friendship. I've been a firm believer that if you want to put a real friendship together, you don't charge for it. And let me tell you, many times, thousands of people have said to me, this person cares about me. They are the only non-paid person in my life. And I can't tell you what the difference that makes to somebody who's dealing with mental illness. Just knowing that this person cares enough to spend time with them makes all the world of difference to them.